Anyone who knows and loves cats knows and loves the fact that there are some things about them we can never know. And Oscar the cat, who lives amongst terminally ill patients at the Steer Nursing Home in Providence, Rhode Island, Oscar. seems to have one especially inexplicable ability. We've noticed that if someone's in the dying process, he will curl up on the bed almost to comfort that person through their last hours. Mary Miranda and her colleagues didn't notice it just once or twice. He's done this 25 times in the two years he's been with us. And he's never been wrong? No. That's amazing. Yeah. It's like clockwork. <laughs> two to four hours before someone dies, Oscar shows up. Quite often, this is actually the first um, trigger for, for the nursing staff to realize that somebody may be actually about to expire. Oscar's eerie ability caught the eye of Dr. David Dosa, who treats patients here and teaches at Brown University. He was so impressed, he wrote about Oscar, who's just about two, in today's issue of the prestigious New England Journal of Medicine. I think Oscar is a truly remarkable cat. Oscar's unique talents can mean the world to patients with so little time left. It's not just that he lets the medical staff know when the end is near, but Dr. Dosa believes the cat might make it a little easier for patients to die. He absolutely provides an unbelievable service to the patients that he serves. So this is no joke? This is no joke. He is able to provide compassionate care for patients that might otherwise die alone. So how does he do it? How does Oscar know? Dr. Nicholas Dodman is one of the world's most renowned animal behaviorists. When they perceive something we can't, we say, you know, it's, it's magic or it's a mystery. In fact, it's just their superior senses in that respect. Whatever motivates Oscar, he is dedicated to his role. He never leaves this floor voluntarily and seems interested almost solely in his mission. He is not a cat that will spend quality time with residents on the ward unless they're about to die. And he's just a cat. Oh, sure. He's miserable half the time, lays all over my charts, won't let me get my work done and wants his treats and then be left alone. But then when he feels that there's something wrong, he steps right up. And for that, he has been cited by a Rhode Island Hospice Association. The Oscar Award hangs near where he works and lives. One cat unlike any other, at least most of the time. Richard Schlesinger, CBS News, Providence, Rhode Island.